Hi, my name is Lisa Allen. Welcome to the English lesson. En esta lección tenemos un objetivo, comparar dos cosas usando adjetivos correctamente. Adjetivos comparativos son nuestro contenido conceptual. El profesor de inglés va a explicar un proyecto especial para la clase. Empezamos. Let's begin. Adjectives. What do you know about adjectives? Here, we have two cars. Let's describe the two cars with adjectives. First, the green car. Dark color. Short. Slow. Cheap. Fun. The yellow car. Light color. Long, fast, expensive, professional. All of these words describe the cars. They are adjectives. But what if we want to compare the two cars? What do we do with the adjectives? Let's compare two things. To compare, for example, two cars, the adjective has to change forms. So, we count the syllables in the adjective. One or two syllables, we add ER at the end of the word. For example, the word long has one syllable, long. So, we add ER longer. The word dark, dark, one syllable, so we add ER, darker. Heavy, how many syllables? Heavy, two syllables, so we add ER, but look at the word heavy. Heavy ends with a Y. In front of the Y is a consonant. So, we change the Y to an I and then add ER. The word fine, one syllable, finer. But look at the word fine. If the word ends with a silent E, we change the, take the E away and put ER. And the word big. Big is also one syllable, big. So, look at the word big. It's another special word. It has a G, one consonant, and one short vowel sound, I, big. If the vowel sound is short, I, and there's only one consonant, add another consonant and ER, bigger. What if the word has three or more syllables? Then we can't use ER anymore. Now we use the word more, mas, or less, menos, in front of the adjective. Example, beautiful, beautiful, three syllables. So we put more beautiful or less beautiful. The word expensive, three syllables, so we put more or less expensive. Complicated, four syllables, so we put more or less complicated, no ER. Organized, organized, more or less in front of the word. To compare two things, use the word than after the adjective. So you add ER or you add more or less and then the word than. Let's try. Let's compare two things. How about our two cars? The yellow car is longer than the green car. Look at the adjective. The original word is long. One syllable. Long. So, E-R, longer, and the word than, longer than. The yellow car is 
faster than the green car. Fast, faster, faster than. The yellow car is more expensive than the green car. Now, the word expensive, expensive, three syllables. We can't put ER. We put more expensive than. The green car is darker than the yellow car. Darker. The green car is less professional than the yellow car. Professional. Four syllables. So we use less in front of the word and than. The green car is slower than the yellow car. Now it's time for you to practice. Write the correct form of the adjective. If nothing is being compared, leave the adjective in its regular form. What does that mean? I'll give you a sentence. The adjective is in parentheses. You change the adjective if we're comparing two things. But if we're not comparing, leave the adjective normal. Example, Tuesday was rainy Wednesday. We're comparing Tuesday and Wednesday. What do you do with rainy? Tuesday was rainier than Wednesday. Now look at rainy. It has a Y with a consonant. Change the Y to an I and add ER. Number two. Yesterday was a great day. What are we comparing? Nothing. Yesterday was a great day. Three, the students in the 10th grade class are fast in math work. Look for the comparison. Nothing. Fast stays the same. Number four, San Pedro Sula is hot Tegucigalpa. Two cities. San Pedro Sula is hotter than Tegucigalpa. Look at hotter. One consonant, T, short vowel, A, two T's, hotter than. Textbooks for school are expensive novels. Textbooks Novels, more expensive than. And number six, the last one. On Monday, Kelly's work was neat on Tuesday. Monday, Tuesday, her work changed. It was neater than. Very good. There are six new words in the lesson. Fun, expensive, organized, beautiful, complicated, and textbook. Hemos alcanzado nuestro objetivo, comparar dos cosas usando adjetivos correctamente. Adjetivos comparativos son nuestros contenidos conceptuales. Thank you for your attention.